Okay, Craig, thank you. you All right, even people who aren't usually college football fans get pretty excited when it's the duel in the desert. So imagine what it was like in the stadium tonight. ABC 15's Lauren Vargas is there live. And Lauren, has it been as crazy as expected? Yeah, Stephanie, those lucky enough to score a ticket are just a few feet away from me right now inside the stadium. But earlier today, all those people and more were spilled out onto these streets, enjoying a tailgate that lasted all day. Some call it the duel in the desert. Arizona! Bear down! But it could also be known as Arizona's biggest party. Who's going to win tonight? ASU, baby. Go Devils all the way. Extravagant tailgates are not hard to come by. We invested some money into the making it a big party for all the Devil fans. And team loyalties run deep. My dad went here. I went here. Um, second generation. So we were brought up yeah. being ASU fans and wanting to beat the Wildcats. And even in a house divided. How much slack do you get for being with this guy right here? Well, he's getting more than I am. The energy is palpable. I'm excited and determined. Some fans have their theories on the outcome. Last year, we were the, we were the favorites. ASU beat us. The year before that, we came here. ASU was the favorites to beat them. Underdog wins this game every time. And we're going to take him down tonight. But even with this historic rivalry, everyone's goal is to enjoy. It's for bragging rights, and it's always it's always clean fun. Like you can you can trash talk the other team throughout the day, but in the end, it's it all comes down to class, and it all comes down to who's better on the football field, and, and it's just fun to watch Over. these guys fight it out. Now the game is not over yet, but we're sure that party will continue well into the into the night for the winners of this game, which should be decided pretty soon. Yeah, no doubt. Stay away from Mill Avenue tonight. That's for sure. Lauren, thank you so much.